Hey everybody, is it on now? Not yet. No, it's buffering. Now you are. Hey everybody, thanks for joining us. Okay, your countdown was just a little bit too early. <laughs> How is everybody tonight? Let me look in the chat and welcome everybody in. Angie was first. Patsy Craftsy. Hey guys. Susan Ironside. Appreciate you coming in tonight. Gail A. K. Barb. Anna Mora. Patricia White. And Joe. I appreciate you all coming in tonight. Lori Reeves. Cindy Loves Jewelry. CND. I'm scrolling down slowly. John's reminding me. Um, do y'all hear any echoing? John's the side of me, and sometimes I get a little echo, but sometimes it's just me hearing my voice before it goes over the broadcast. So if you hear anything, let us know. We're still working on things. Um, Brenda was going to be here tonight right up until about 730 and her boyfriend Jeff got very violently sick. Um, so she is with him. Uh, I've got to send her a link where she's going to pop on if she can and say hello to us and maybe do a little bit. Um, <clears throat> we, I've had a rough couple of days, but today's been pretty good. Yeah, Jeff usually is pretty cool to get sick, and he helps her a lot like John does. He'll sit down and write down who gets what for her so she can just roll on like I do. Um, so she's having to tend to him. You know how men are when they get sick. <laughs> okay, um, for the first person that was in tonight in the chat, which is, so get this, Angie, I'm going to send her a special surprise. Um, for being the first one ready and waiting. Okay, guys, um, we're going to do as we usually do. It's on um, bids. We do take 50 cent, 25 cent increments. Um, if you've not bought from me before, which everybody in here has. Um, so don't need to worry about it. But if somebody hasn't and they're just watching and haven't spoke up, if you could send um, your info to me, I'm going to put up my email, it has mine and Brenda's, but um, mine is the JW Layton. You could just send PayPal email and address, your your phys, your mailing address to JW Layton at yahoo.com. That will help me figure the shipping and get your things together. I'm sorry I'm having a little bit of allergies and don't know where that stuff is from. Um, but what we'll do is we'll have some items. We'll have a couple of giveaways tonight. I do have some jewelry jars and jewelry bags. So if that's something you're interested in seeing, let me know. Each one is over a pound up to about three pounds. Um, <clears throat> and it depends on, on the three pound one, how high the price goes. I can throw extra things in and I can throw a piece of sterling silver in if it reaches a certain amount. So we got lots of fun things. We're going to have a couple of giveaways tonight. One of the giveaways is going to go by um, picking a number. And then the other one is going to go by who answers a trivia question the quickest. And the reason I do it two different ways is I have had some people say that they're having a lot of lag. So I want it, it to be them to have a fair chance at at least winning one. <laughs> Did Lynn come in? I'm trying to make sure I don't miss him. Hey, Lynn. Trying to make sure I don't miss anybody. Okay. If anybody's got any questions, um, you can let me know. Anything that you want to see. I have a wide variety of things, as you all know. I, um, rings, bracelets, necklaces, um, earrings, and I have everything from regular fashion jewelry. Hey, Diane. 
glad you could join us. Hey, Barbie Craft. Hey, Barbie. I have everything from uh, regular fashion jewelry on up to um, sterling with real gemstones. My helper's a little noisy tonight. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to start out with our first piece. I know I've got people that do love gemstones. Um, I have an agate slice, kind of a mossy green. There is some patterning in the middle. And I have put it on because the bell of it was a coppery color. I have put it on a copper chain that's in the scroll design. And it's kind of a heavyweight chain because this is a heavy, you know, heavyweight. It wouldn't look right with a little rinky dinky thing. Um, it is an older piece. It does have a fold over clasp. And on the back, I know you're not going to be able to read it, but it does say solid copper. Hey, Roland. Hey, Mike. Roland is Mike. I'm trying to tell my husband your name so he can kind of get to know who you are. So we're going to start out with this solid copper scroll link chain and this agate slice here. It's in a moss screen. And the starting bid is at $5. <clears throat> the nice polished piece still has the rough edges. Okay, Angie in at five. John? I, I'm just getting um, going on grumpy the uh, okay. emails. Okay, All right, well, we got Anna at six. Who and wants to give me 650 or seven? It's a really weighty. Uh, Nice chain with the fold over class. This is solid copper. It's really pretty. I got Barbie in at 650. Who wants to give me seven? Has a nice sound with the chain hitting the agate slice. It sounds like wind chimes. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Whoops. We have found that if John gets too close to his base with his headset on, we get a little feedback. So we're working on that. Anybody want to go more than 650 or are we going to start calling for Barbie? Because we're going to move this thing. And the chain is a pretty long change. Give me just a second. Let me tell you the length. It's actually a 24 inch chain. So we got Barbie Craft at 650. So get this is out. My hair is so long. I got to get it cut. Hey, Autumn. So we're going to start calling for Barbie Craft at 650, going once. Hey, Selena. Thanks for coming in. Hey, Cricket. Hey, Cricket. I love this chain. Going twice for six fifty. Final warning. Sold to Barbie for six fifty. Thank you, Barbie. Is there anything that people would prefer to see or you just want me, thank you, Lynn, or you just want me to pull things and see what we got. I don't wear it down. It's so heavy and long that um, it makes me sweat sometimes, but I do like it better down. I feel like it balances me out. <laughs> Let's see what I've got here. I have got a set of... Um, Gold tone earrings. They are like a 3D pineapple. Makes They're me hungry. hungry. <laughs> What's making you hungry? The pineapple? Pineapple. Oh, my goodness. Um, 
and they're 3D. They're they're a um kind of a medium gold tone. No color loss on them at all. They are the French hooks. Um, I'd like to start these at three dollars if anybody's interested. They're very cute. In the south, the pineapple is um, the sign of hospitality. We got Mike in at three. And any other place is the sign of some good fruit. <laughs> Thank you, Mike. Anybody in at three fifty? I'm gonna, if you want to bid, you better put your things in quick because we're gonna be calling quick, quick, quick. I got lots of things I want to get through tonight. Okay, John, start calling it for Mike. All right. Going once for Mike at $3. Thank you, Cricket. Going twice for $3 for Mike. Ooh, do crab So to three dollars to Mike. Thank you, Mike. Thank you, Mike. Barbie, I got one um one at least, if not two, that love crab and doings, right? Yes. <laughs> Going on grumpy bit on the stand. <laughs> I hear you. I got those from uh, Blandine. She had a bunch to sell, and um, Brenda and I both got some. I got two of them. They're really cute. Let's see what I got here. I'm looking for something. Okay, I like um kind of art glass that um actually has the yeah <laughs> the stand is cute that um has dichroic glass also featured in it. This is a silver tone chain. That's an older one. It's got the fold over clasp. Let's see if it's marked anywhere. No, it's not marked anywhere. Um, I have this piece. Now it is on a, it's kind of got a copper colored bell. I'm going to get this stream yard figured out like everybody else said. I just put it on the silver one. I thought it looked good with it. It is a purpley cobalt blue with some dichroic uh, features inside of it. It is, um, there is some texture and these that are the goldish pink color, you can actually feel on the outside. This pendant with the chain, <clears throat> I'm gonna start out at $4 if anybody's interested. Starting out at $4. If no one's interested, you can say pass. We can move along to other things. I do have some different uh, glass pendants that I've put on chains. Who wants to give me four dollars or two passes? This chain is. This chain is almost 24 inches also. We got one pass. Okay. Hey, Patsy, I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing better than I was yesterday. So that's always a, a plus. We got two passes. Okay, we'll pass Three on. Passes. Brooches are right there. Huh? Just your brooches are right there beside you. What size did you say this was on the right hand? Six. I've got a ring that's kind of like a little wraparound ring. It's a kitty ring. Um, the, cat, the cat has little red eyes. There's this tail. I'm. Sh it can be opened up. I'm sure or closed more. Um. Right now, as it sits, it is at a six. 
Let me show it on my finger. I'm going to start this off at $4. That's cute. Starting this kitty ring out at $4, size six. But it is, it is kind of adjustable. Got Mike at four. Yeah, it's a cat. So get this, and Lori got beat out. Who okay. wants to give me four fifty or five? We got Lori in at five. I like it. That's not as cute as my cat, so that's why I didn't keep. <laughs> what is it made of? It is just silver tone. Anybody five fifty or six? We got so get this at five fifty. I'll pull the sterling out later, Barb. Mike is out. Lori at five seventy five. So get this. You want to go six? So get this is out. So start calling for Lori. Go on once for five seventy five for Lori. Going twice for five seventy five for Lori. She said make it six. All right, we'll make it six dollars. You're fine. So right. for Lori. Okay. We're just trying to show you a variety of things while we're here. I don't know if I've got into any um, vintage brooch kind of people in, but I'm going to show you something <clears throat> I think is really cute. And let's see. The name of it is Pastelli. P-A-S-T-E-L-L-I. Hey, this Pastelli. This is brooch. This is the back of it. It also has a matching pair of earrings. So to make it easier for me to hold, I'm going to hold one earring and the brooch. <clears throat> but this set, it's a named set. There's no, the name is on the back of the earring. And there's really no wear or color loss on these at all. For this set, which is a named set, I'm going to start these at $5. I mean, yeah, $5. So starting this brooch with a set of earrings for $5. Mike, give me five. Anybody, five fifty or six? Cindy Les Jewelry is at five fifty. Mike's at six. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Anybody six fifty or seven? Yeah, I thought it was really neat. Cindy loves jewelry at six fifty. Someone just asked you a question. Um, Mike's in at seven. Thelma, it looks to be the the top color, which is either a pearl white or a silver white, looks to be enamel. And I don't see any enamel loss. We had Cindy at seven fifty and it might be out at eight. It's mainly a gold tone.
Who wants to give me 850 or nine? And let us know when you're out, so we'll move along. Cindy's at 850. This is one I've had I've been holding on to for a little bit. Hey, Thelma, thanks for coming in. So we're sitting at 850. Mike's in at 950. Anybody at 10? Thank you, everyone, for your bids. So we're sitting in at 950. Anybody wants to go 10? Cindy's out. Call, calling it for Mike, but 950. Going once. Going twice. Fair warning. Sold to Mike for 950. Thank you, Mike and Cindy, you, Mike. for being. Where'd my help go? <laughs> I've got a fun little ring. It's just these little balls. They do move. It's on a silver toned ring. The ring, I've tried to measure things beforehand. The ring is a seven and a half. It's on a little thin band. There is no wear on it. Let's start this out at a dollar. Starting this uh, ring out at a dollar. This is like grapes. <laughs> it's black, though. They're black. Could be black grapes. Could be black grapes. <laughs> All right, Josie gives me one. Who wants to give me one? 50 or two? Just a fun little ring. Okay, start calling it for on oh, Josie. Going once for a dollar at Josie. Going twice to Josie for a dollar. Fair warning. Sold to Josie for a dollar. Thank you, Josie. I've got a pair of earrings. It's kind of a, a brass or like a bronze brass tone. They have an articulated bottom with movement. They are a little, little longer. They have cream enamel. They're on the hooks. I don't see any color loss or wear. We're going to start these out at two dollars. This nice set of it. Earrings for two dollars. Who wants to give me two? If you're not interested, just put pass up with two passes. I'll move on to something else. These are cute. They'll carry you right into the fall. Patsy Craftsman is at it too. All right. Thank you, Patsy. Anybody else for 250 
All right, so we had two pasta, but we're going to go ahead and sell it to Patsy Crafty for $2. All right. Thank you, Patsy. Hey, Triple C. Hey. Okay. Trying to get a little variety with everything. Got this really cute bracelet, silver tone. There is some open work in it. This is black enamel in a diamond shape. It is magnetic. So it makes it easy to put on. I will measure it for you ladies. Give me just a minute. Hey, Ronnie. Hey, Ronnie, thanks for coming in tonight. If you would like to um, purchase something or to participate in the auction, this is almost eight inches long. Oh, Jeannie, okay. <laughs> but this is um, magnetic. It's right at eight inches. It's silver tone. There are some open components with black enameling. We're going to start this at $4 if there's anyone that's interested. Who wants to give me $4 for this bracelet? Gail lays in at four. It's really cute, Gail. The magnetic, the magnet's good and strong. I like magnetic stuff. Cindy, you want to go four fifty or five? That's it on my wrist. I like the Patty magnet. Because at 450. you don't really see a clasp. Gail A's in at five. Hey, Patty. Patty's my North Carolina neighbor here. Cindy's in at 550. Who wants to give me six? Gail gives me six. 650 or seven. Well, see, I even got to find where the class is. There it is. This is the inside of the bracelet. There's no wear anywhere. That's the magnet on the inside. Sandy's in at six fifty dollars. Yes. Cindy's in at 650. Thank you for the support, Susan. No problem, Susan. Just glad you're here. There's no pressure to buy. We're here to have fun. Um, when I do giveaways, giveaways are open to everyone, whether you've purchased or not. Of We've got Patty Cannon at 7, Gail at 750. I appreciate all your purchases, though. It does <clears throat> help me since I'm not able to physically make any money for my family right now. I cannot believe it's um Tuesday will be four weeks since I've had this surgery. I've got a follow up this Wednesday, so we'll see what happens then. So we're Patty Kane's out going once for Gelf at seven fifty. Going twice for Gail for seven fifty. Fair warning. Mm, a little bit better. The last couple of days hasn't been great, but I took about a four hour nap this afternoon before the auction, so I'm feeling pretty good. Sold to Gail for seven fifty. Thank you, Gail. Okay, I love a stretch ring. 
This one looks basically brand new. No wear on it at all. Stretch rings are cool because you can wear them on a multitude of fingers. This one has an oval hammered disc. I like it when you've got a longer um, ring. It actually elongates your finger. I'm going to start this one out at $3. The stretchy ring, starting it out at $3. Who wants to give me three? I'll put it on my little stand so it's easier for me to hold. Goes in at three. Hey, Frugal. Hey. Thanks for coming tonight. I'm going to have some brooches. Frugal, you missed a cute brooch and clip earring set that was the name brand Pastelli. I'll try to pull something else out. Mike got that. Brenda is not here tonight. Um, she may try to come in a little bit later. Her boyfriend, uh, Jeff is his name, uh, got very violently sick um, about seven o'clock. She had planned on being here and um, it's not, he's not good. It's kind of like stomach virus kind of symptoms, but to the violent extreme. So she's helping take care of him. All right, we're going one time for Gail at $3. Um, Triple C, I appreciate that, and I appreciate all your guys' prayers. Um, yeah, it's hard. When I first had my surgery, I was only sleeping about two hours at the time and not sleeping much at all because of the pain, and I was crying, and I was like, oh. I said, how much more can I take of this? It's Going worked. twice for Gail for three dollars. It's worked out, but I'm going to get better, and I promise. I, hopefully, in a, maybe another month, I'm going to tell you guys I'm sleeping great. Fair warning. <laughs> so to Gail for three dollars. I got a little gold tone ring that has the two straight. It's got two parallel lines and two vertical lines, horizontal and vertical. There are um, rhinestones on them. This ring is a six and three fourths. Um, I was going to wear it on my pinky, but the top band is a little, my pinky short. <laughs> The top band's a little too loose. I was afraid I was going to lose it. Um, there is no wear. There is no name branding on it. I just think it's a very cute little ring. Um, I got it kind of with the looking like the Roman numeral two because I'm a Gemini. I'm going to start this one in at $3. Yeah, there's no marking on it. This is very cute. Six and three quarters, Mike. It could even be worn um, like um, Kelly Hip Flip and Mama does, kind of um, as a knuckle ring. I think it's really cute. Josie's in at $3. <laughs> All right, Susan. Anybody three fifty or four? Yeah, I like it. I thought it was really neat. But just my finger tapers too soon and it I was afraid I was gonna lose it. Going once for Josie at three. Going twice for Josie at three. Fair warning. Thank Sold you. Sold to Josie for three dollars. Thank you, Josie. A 
Okay, I have this. Um, I'm pretty sure it's faux leather. It's got little flowers with uh, rhinestones in it. Kind of a bronze color. This is the back of it. On the snap, the name brand is W, and it's got a star, Y. Thung, F-E-N-G. So I think it's really cute. I like the little leather or faux leather bracelets. Hey, um, Mayor. How long it is. It's eight inches long. It does have two snaps um, where you could snap it um, closer or further away. I'm going to start this one in at $4. It is a named piece. Really cute. Mayor commented. Hey, Mayor. Lori's in at four. Thank you, Mayor. What, what color? Is it like a silver? It's kind of like a bronze colored faux leather to me. It's um, a brownish bronze. Very, it's the one that would be very neutral. I could see you wearing with a lot of things. I like the flowers with the uh, rhinestones in it. It's got a lot of sparkle. We got Lorianna for anybody four fifty or five. Thanks, everybody, for coming in. Calling once for $4 for Lori. All right. Thank you, Lori. I have an older, these are an older vintage style of um, faux pearl earrings. It looks um, silver tone with the paper. They look like little um, grapes. They've got the little beading on the bottom. And these are a more vintage pair. There is no name brand on them that I could find. Um, I'm going to start these out at $4. Hey, Kathleen. Hey, Kathleen. Yeah, they do look like grapes. These are pearl grapes. <laughs> Might send it four. And these are not heavy, so if you worry about earrings being too heavy, they're not heavy. You got a lot of movement. Pineapples and grapes. I'm gonna make you hungry. <laughs> that sounds good. Some Anybody fresh, four fifty or five? Some fresh pineapple and some green seedless grapes. Yeah, those are some of Mayor's favorites. We're gonna call it. Sold to Mike for four dollars. Thank you, Mike. Okay. For some of you people who like maybe a little more delicate, I'll give me just a second. I'm pulling it out. I'm looking for a name. Don't see any name. It's a lobster claw. It's gold and silver. The hearts are kind of, they alternate between a brushed silver and a shiny silver. The gold is a gold wavy that actually has texture. It does have a lobster claw clasp. There is no name on it. This is the other end. There is no wire. Let me measure it right quick. 
It's dead on a seven. I'm gonna start this out at three dollars. It is really cute. Bye, Meredith. Have a good night at work. No, she was talking to uh, Jenny. Bye, Jenny. This is really cute. It actually gives the appearance of being real 14 karat. The color is dead on. All right, so good. If this one out, it's three dollars. Patsy Crafty's at four. So get this is at four fifty. Lori's out. Oh, okay, Mayor. Patsy, you want to go five? Yeah, it's pretty, Selena. But you know you and I like bigger, bolder things. <laughs> okay, start calling. Ask us out. Mm -hmm. Go on once. Just so get this for 450. Go on twice to Angie at 450. Sold to Angie for 450. Thank you, Angie and Patsy. And Lori. And Lori. Sorry. Okay. I have a really pretty um, gold tone bracelet. Fold over clasp. I don't think it's vintage or anything. It's got beautiful stones. They're olive, kind of a wine burgundy color and pink with some clear stones. There is no wear on it at all. Let me measure it right quick. Frugal, I actually have my laptop inside of my light box. Um, I copied one of Dia's when she was doing a demonstration on how to make a big um, light box that doesn't cost a lot with mostly Dollar Tree items. Um, so I made one and I put my laptop inside. This is a seven inch. I'm going to show you the inside so you can see. It's nowhere. Sorry. Going to start this one at $6. This has got a lot of sparkle. <laughs> it's beautiful. Johnny, John, you're jiggling. John's added another device in here and it started making noises. Yeah, it is really pretty. All right, like we've got Lori at six, Josie at seven, Mike at seven fifty, Josie oh, at eight. It's, it's it's echoing really bad and making a feedback noise. I'm trying. You want me to just kick you out? Yeah, yeah. Just kick the iPhone out. I'm trying. Hold on just a second. Wait, I got it. Wait, I got it. There. Sorry about that. <laughs> Josie's in at nine. All right, it's gorgeous. Oh, it's it actually sparkles like um, real stones. It's giving off some rainbow effect. <laughs> John in there for a minute. All right, I'm going to start calling it for Josie at nine. Yes. So get Angie in at 9.50. Angie swooped in there, Josie, on your 9.50. That is really pretty. Josie's I like that. in at 10. Angie, you want to go 10.50 or 11?
Yes, I don't blame Josie. If my wrist was just a little bit smaller. I would have kept this. This is beautiful. And it looks it looks so real. Go on once. Andy's out. Go on once for Josie for 10. Go on twice. Fair warning. So to Josie for 10. Thank you, Josie and Angie. I've got a really cute set here. It is um, rose gold tone. Has a very small kind of a Rolo link chain into these individual stations. These um, stations are made to sim simulate opalite. Um, they have one row around it that's just like gold beading or embossing and the outside row is um, tiny, almost like pave set rhinestones. The earrings are an identical match to the necklace. So for this set, I would like to start it out at $6. It does have an extender, a long extender on the back. Corey's in at six. Patsy, six fifty or seven. This is so pretty. I'll hold it up close to you so you can see. That rose gold is really pretty. At the end of seven. The earrings are um, French hooks. The lobster claw clasp. No name brand on it that I see. What I think is cute is at the end of the extender, there's a little rhinestone down at the bottom. Lorianna A. A big ugly plastic Selena. <laughs> That's the end of the day. Lori, you want to go nine? Lori's in at nine. Patsy, you want to go nine? Pick? Rose gold? Yes, it's rose gold colored. Just rose gold stone. <laughs> That's okay. We all have our likes, Selena. Patsy's in at 10. Lori, you want to go 10, 50, or 11? Lori's out. Going once for Patsy for 10. A beautiful set, Patsy. I love it. Going twice for Patsy at 10. Okay. All right, Lori. Sold to Patsy for $10. Thank you. Thank you, ladies, for bidding. I'm trying to get some help to reach something. That one. This one. Way back. <laughs> Okay, I've got a necklace here. It is Hallmark. Leah Sophia. Leah Sophia. It's four strands. This is all um 
I don't think there's any glass or anything. This one feels a little cool, and this one does, but I don't know. It's silver tone. It's got some oranges and olives, and there's a peach color here. I love the little filigree piece here. It does have the tag, the Hallmark tag on the back. It is um, lobster claw with an extender. This to me almost looks mother of pearlish, and it's one that feels a little cool. But like I said, I don't, I don't know. It can give, it may be a faux piece given the appearance of these ones. The bigger chunk ones like that feel a little cool. They may be some kind of stone or glass. Um, this one is a good piece to transition you from summer into fall. Um, we're going to start this one at six dollars. Starting this is six dollars. The bronze, the metallic bronze here. Beautiful. Love this. If you love greens, there's lots of shades of green. It's really pretty. It is Hallmark Leah Sophia. No wear, no discoloration at all. There's Hallmark. Six dollars. Who wants to start me off at six dollars? If you're not interested, just put pass. We got one pass. Six dollars or another pass. We got two paths. Hey, CT. Okay. We'll just save this for another day. This is on a vinyl cord with an extender. It has, um, Various beads. It's metal. It's different shades of metal. They're just gold time. This is a feather. There are some there. This is um so oxidized to look the green color, but there is gold, silver, and copper. If anybody would like to start this for four dollars. Lobster claw clasp. There is no name on it. It is pretty, Lori, in it. Thanks, Lynn. We got Lori in it for. I like this. The back of it. That's the back. It's just it's made to look a little distressed. Looks a little hammered. I'm there. Back again. Sitting at four dollars for Lori. Anybody four fifty or five? Hey, hey Kim. Kim. Hey Pete. Hey. That's okay, Diane. You do what you need to do. Going once for Lori at four dollars. Welcome back, Diane. Going twice for four dollars for Lori. Fair warning. So to Lori for four dollars. Thank you, Lori.
okay, if there's anything in particular you guys would like to see, please let me know. Certain thing, I do have spiraling. We can do whatever you want to do. Okay, got a little pair of earrings. They're pink ones. Gold tone with clear rhinestones and a little eye. It's black. I'm going to start these out at $4 if anybody's interested. They are post back. They are beautiful. Nothing wrong with them. No color loss. Um, I don't think so, Patsy. That's one thing I don't have. I hope everybody got their packages this past week and um, we're happy with them. Who wants a little penguin for four bucks? They're so cute. Hi, Storage Pirate. They're cute. Thank you, Diane. I got to get you some more pendant necklaces. I'm about to tap my supply out. <laughs> I know those are your favorite things. I like them too. Does everybody want to pass on these? If not, I'll be glad to wear them. They're gorgeous. Thank you, Diane. Who wants to buy these for four dollars? Type in penguin. We're going to do a buy it now. Yes, okay, those are little penguins. If you want them for $4, type in penguin. No stones missing, nothing. Thank you, Selena. I try to make sure I'm... <laughs> You're overloaded with jewelry frugal. Nobody wants the little penguins? Okay. I'm going to take them away. If somebody decides they want them later, let me know. Okay. I have a box set here. The name brand of this is Blank Canvas. It actually comes in its box. I had one of these the other uh, weekend that had a bee. This one is a pineapple has earrings here. I love the chain that it's not just a solid one link kind of chain. It has a pineapple. The pineapple is hollow on the back. I'm going to get this stream yard stuff right. It has a little disc that mimics the earrings and this is a real freshwater pearl. So this is ready for gift giving. Got it in the box and everything. I'm going to start this out at $6 if anybody's interested. I love the chain. Yeah, Mike got those pineapple earrings uh -huh. earlier. Yep. Pineapples are cute. This is a really cute set already in the box. Um, yes, I do have animal necklaces, pendants, brooches. I will pull those out. All right, Mike. All right, my is six. They're nice for gift giving if you're looking ahead for Christmas or any of you resellers. It's already in the box. All right, anybody six fifty or seven? Uh, 
going once to Mike for six dollars. All right. Sold to Mike for six dollars. Thank you. I think I do have some cameos. I'm, I actually have a cameo brooch that is uh, sterling silver. Um, we'll take a look at that. Let me grab, since Autumn Grace had asked for the animal necklaces, let me see if I have those. Don't see. Okay, but I also have some more. Um, yeah. Now, just a minute while I'm grabbing them. I'll try to grab them. Where's your what? A little bear. Yeah. Okay. All right. What we'll do is we're going to start out. We've got an elephant. Patsy, this could kind of be called a jelly belly. It's not, you know, the real jelly bellies were a particular name brand by a company, and they were most always clear. But now um, people are kind of calling jelly bellies anything that has a stone in where the belly is. This is an elephant. He's got rhinestones on his ear. He's not missing any. He's kind of a 3D, so that's the back side of him. It's on a, it's a silver tone on a silver tone rope chain. It is a lot of claw and it does have an extender. We're going to start this one out at $6. It is a solid black. Jim, I believe it's acrylic. What size is it? <laughs> uh, you need a measure. I'm just a Angie's in at six. You find all the other animal necklaces. There's a giraffe, but there's also another elephant, and there's a couple of other things too. With the extender, it's about 24 and a half. All right, we're sitting at six dollars. Anybody six fifty or seven? Well, if I can keep it up here so you guys can see it. It's really cute. Uh, the silver tone is oxidized. He's got some bumpy skin. The um, rhinestones are a dark color. Get his little tail and little trunk up. The bell even has some texturing on it. Okay, if nobody else is bidding, go ahead and start calling. They're gonna miss out on little elephant. Going once to Angie for six. Going twice. Fair warning. Not sure if I have lions, but I will check. So. Okay. Don't make a whole bag. I kind of separated them in a bag. So. Where did you put the bag? Where? Okay. I have a giraffe. Silver tone giraffe. He's got green eyes. Green eyes there. And it is a shorter Nicholas. Give me just a second. Let me measure it for you. It's an 18 inch. On silver tone. There's the eye. There's the eye. We're going to start this one off at three. This is a little smaller. Does have a bigger bell, so he could accommodate a heavier chain if you had one, or probably a cord if you wanted to put on like a leather cord. No, Susan, we don't have any live elephants or graphs. I got some dogs that think they're wild animals in a cat. 
<laughs> Anybody wants to give me three dollars? I do have a B. I think I have a B in one of those boxed sets, like the blank canvas. I can pull that out. Yes, if you find it is the brooch cameos too. I think I got some cameo brooches and some cameo earrings. I'm not sure. I may have gotten rid of all my. Maybe I got one or two necklaces. Dalton's helping me look. Okay, if you're not interested, just pass and we'll move along. Three dollars. Who wants to give me three? Such a cute little giraffe for just three dollars. Three dollars, Autumn. Autumn, give me three. All right, Autumn. I know you like animals. This going to end up in your keep pile. <laughs> we all got a keep pile and a sale pile. And <laughs> All right. Just go ahead and uh, do final warning, then let's call it for Autumn so we can. Final warning. <laughs> Sold Autumn for three dollars. Thank you, Autumn. No luck. All right, I'm going to show you a brooch or two. Well, these brooches got caught up. They wanted to be together. Okay, this brooch is an older one. It's marked Made in Germany. It's kind of a filigreed um, gold toned butterfly. There is two layers to the butterfly. It has this type of thick hook closure, has a pink stone in it. Since it is a vintage one made in Germany, um, I want to start this out at $5. Butterfly starting out at $5. Who wants to give me five? It's two layers to the butterfly. Lori gave me five. Lori, it's pretty. Anybody five, fifty, or six? That's the class. Going once to Lori for five dollars. Going twice to Lori for five dollars. Fair warning. Sold to Lori for five dollars. Thank you, Lori. I do have a copper tone um, teddy bear. He's holding a silver heart. That's what the back of him looks like. We'll start this out at three dollars. Who wants the teddy bear for three dollars? Safety's in at three. Autumn three fifty or four. Lori's in at four. Four fifty or five. Autumn's in at five. Who wants to go five fifty or six? Safety's in at six. 
Who wants to give me six fifty or seven? Looks like he's being carried away by love. Lori's out. Autumn six fifty or seven. Autumn's out. Safety going once for six dollars. Going twice for safety at six dollars. Fair warning. So the safety for six dollars. Thank you for all your bids. Thank you, Cynthia. I do have a B brooch. The silver tone has some black enamel and looks like um, maybe faux marcasite. Looks like a happy B. That's the back. There's no particular name brand. We're going to start him out at $4. Who wants to give me four dollars for this non-stinging bee? <laughs> I don't know the pen could sting you, couldn't it? <laughs> Lori's in at six. Nope, Lori retracted. Four. Lori's in at four. <laughs> Who wants to give me four fifty or five? Okay. Anybody four fifty or five? Go ahead and start calling for Lori. Going once for Lori at four dollars. Yeah, you, you might be glad you retracted that, Lori. <laughs> <laughs> Going twice for Lori at four dollars. Fair warning. He looks happy. <laughs> so to Lori for four hours. Thank you, Lori. Okay. I have a really cute owl. It is on kind of like a bronze chain. It's the figure on link. This owl has uh, clear rhinestones. His body is um, made up uh, on the back of the chain. Things, but there's um, sparkly amber colored beads. Um, they've got like an AB coating on them, and there's those little feathers. I'm going to start this one out at five dollars. How long is it, babe? Twenty-four inches long. Twenty-four inches long. Owl necklace. Who wants to give me five? I've not seen one like this before. With the little crystals on the chains. Hey, Ashley. Gloria's in at five. <laughs> Sorry, Frugal. It's been hot as Hades here. We've been in the mid to high 90s. My air conditioner running constantly. Well, 
Lori's in at five. Anybody at five, fifty, or six? That's cute. Owl necklace, twenty-four inches long. Start calling. Going once to Lori for five dollars. Going twice. Glory for five. Ooh, frugal. That's ugly. John works kind of in and out of the weather, so yeah. Fair warning. So the Lori for dollars. Five dollars. Thank you. Thank you, Lori. Okay, I found a cameo. Oh, you think everybody's waiting on one of my bags? All right, well, I'll do this. We'll do a giveaway, then we'll do uh, a bag. How's that sound? Okay. Here's the cameo. Got blue stones. It is a pendant and a brooch. It's on a chain. It's kind of like a Rolo type chain. Going to start this one off at five. Let me tell you how long it is. It's about 28 inches long. My sin at five. It's cute. Barbie, he came in right ahead of you. If you want to go 550 or six. The gold chain is a little brighter than the um, cameo, but it really doesn't detract from it. The closest gold chain that I had here. Mike sent it six. Piercing. Hold it. Hang on just a second. After this, we'll do a giveaway and then we'll do one of my bags. Mike, I hope you, you liked your bag you got from me. Barbie's telling Mike doorbell. Barbie said it's <laughs> That's the trick Barbie does on me. She tries to ring my doorbell. Might send it seven. Does have Going once for Mike, it's seven dollars. Going twice for seven dollars at Mike. Fair warning. Sold to Mike for seven dollars. Thank you, Mike and Barbie. Okay, right now I'm showing we've got 35 people in here, so we're going to get ready to do a giveaway. Let me pick me a giveaway out here. We'll do so, Mike. Oh, that was so sweet. I've got a owl necklace and it's got a little pair of um, yellow. This is going to be our giveaway prize. Okay. Um, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to choose a number between one and a hundred. 
we're going to wait till I say start. Only one number per person. Um, the person closest to the number will win the giveaway. So, you ready? One through 100. Go. Start. One number. Hmm. Everybody is available. Uh, everybody can participate. You haven't had to buy anything. One through one hundred, one number. Okay, put your numbers in as quick as you can because when I call stop, uh, if you put it in after that, it doesn't matter if you had the exact number. Lori, I'm glad you got a cameo. Oh, I've got to adjust myself here for a minute, ladies. When does Lily start school? Anybody else? I'm going to start counting down from 15, 15, 14, 13, 12, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Will you tell her, um, Angie, I know she's going to enjoy this year. Okay, John, do you see who was the closest? We're going to go back and look. My number was 45. Barbie Craft. Barbie won. She was the closest one. Barbie, you were lucky all day yesterday, and now you're lucky today. You get your little owl necklace. Congratulations. Barbie, if you don't buy lottery tickets, maybe you ought to buy at least one. She's been pretty lucky lately. What grade is she going to be in, Angie? Okay. We're going to agility. Fourth grade. <laughs> All right. Let me... Fourth grade's fun. Okay, it's in a jar. This jar is about seven inches high. We weighed it two pounds and 12 ounces without the jar. Okay, I will ship it to you in a baggie. Um, if it gets to a certain price, we will put a piece of sterling silver in. I'm going to kind of show you, but right now it's got all very good high fashion jewelry in here. Um, good quality, nothing broke, all wearable. What are we starting out at? We're going to start this out at 20. There is a piece right here that's a necklace. There's another necklace here. All right, Lori's in at 20. There's a pair of earrings. Those are actually highlight earrings still on the card. There's some glass leopard print earrings. Another pair of earrings on the card. Statement necklace. Mainly a newer vintage. Um, a mixture, mixture of new and vintage. There's two pounds, 12 ounces. And I'll have all different kinds of things. Here is um, a cameo ring that's in here. Somebody saw the cameo, Mama K. <laughs> 
here's a ring see if i can get it around that actually um has black acrylic it looks like a flower we're sitting at twenty dollars there's some american eagle there's name brands patricia white sent at 21 who wants to give me 22 my sent at 22 right there is a brand new uh, stainless steel necklace it has a heart a dove and a cross for um, faith, hope, and love. So Lori's in at 23. Who wants to give me 24? That's a tagged necklace under that goes under here this way. I believe it's the NY necklace. Mike's in at 25. Who wants to give me 26? Lori's in at 26. Who wants to give me 27? If we get to 35, I will throw in a sterling silver piece. So somebody's in there that's already thinking about wanting it you can just go up you can bid yourself up lots of earrings all matches there's a mic's out bracelet. yeah it's got a good assortment in there's two american eagle pieces in here and american eagle uh sells really good on poshmark but they're pretty it's the one with the little chips here and their stone chips uh, would go really good with these earrings. We're sitting at $26. Lori's in at $26. Who wants to give me $27? In here, if you can see the pink, that's a um, vintage pink acrylic um, necklace. It's um, just the round, they kind of look marbled. There's a cuff bracelet there. There's part of that acrylic uh, necklace. There are multiple kinds of bracelets in here. It's packed full. There's the American Eagle hang tag. It says two pounds, 12 ounces of jewelry we're sitting at 26 dollars anybody want to go 27 if we go up to 27 i will throw this um owl ring in it is a mood ring it does change colors hold on just a second i had it blue a while ago yeah, there are good pieces in there, Mike. I've got several others, though. Hey, Don. Hey, Don. Hey, Don. See, it's green now. But if we can get two more dollars and go to 28, I'll put this um, owl mood ring in. Autumn gray sand at 30. All right. We've got the autumn, the moon ring in. Let's see what else. Remember, at 35, she'll throw in a sterling silver piece. Did you say? Mm -mm. What, what did you say you're doing? Mm -mm. At 35. Oh, 35, yeah. Yeah, $35. She'll throw in a sterling silver piece. Lori says she's out. Here's some more vintagey brooch. We can go to 32. I'll throw this in. It's not Hallmark. It looks like a cardinal and his baby. Mike sent it 35. All right, Mike, I'll put this in and a piece of sterling silver. We can go 37. I'll put another owl ring in. Autumn Grace is out. Anybody want to hit 37? Put this out ring in. It is an adjustable ring. Or 36. I'm sorry. Go to 36. We'll get this. <laughs> Lori, I got some more. We'll pull some more out. I got some smaller. This was the big mama tonight. 
We're sitting at 35. All right. Going once to the mic for 35. Going twice to the mic for 35. I'm going to put this. Mike, I'm going to go and put this in for you anyway. Fair warning. Two pounds, 12 ounces. All right. So, Mike. $35. Thank you, Mike. So, John, I can't hold that machine. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Lori, for your bid. Thanks, Adam Grace. I really appreciate you guys. Got some nice surprises in there. Does anybody want to see the stolen silver cameo brooch? As you know, it's not going to go into for into single digits now, guys. I haven't cleaned it other than the spot where the mark was so that I could read everything and it has been tested. It is a sterling silver frame. It is a um, pendant and a brooch. Sterling silver completely around it with marcasite. It has um, a black stone. I'm guessing it's probably onyx um, backing with a um, mother of pearl cameo face. It is not the ponytail one. This is the sterling silver brooch. She looks like a flapper lady to me. She's got a little ribbon that runs through her hair. This is the back, and the 925 is down here on the bottom. Can you see it, John? Let's see if I can shade it. Can you see it? It does have the 925. It was tested. I'm going to start this out at $20. Thanks, Mike. You can see it's held in here does have the bell and the pen. It's very nice. Great just got some mark sites all over it. There you can see her hair do. Kathleen, I'm sorry you're feeling bad. Okay. There maybe you can see her features a little better. It is a mother of pearl face. Who wants to give me twenty dollars? Okay. Joe. Joe is starting us off at twenty. Anybody twenty one? Joe, can you make sure to send your information to me? I don't remember having it. Um, I'll, I mean, you can you can bid now. I, I just all I need your PayPal email and your mailing address to jwlayton at yahoo.com. Just you can do it at the end of the auction. I've seen you in many other ones and know that you honor your obligations. Anybody 21. We're sitting at twenty dollars. This is well worth the twenty dollars. Well worth it. Marka sites have a lot of flash. All right, John, start calling it. We don't have any going there. once. Oh, triple C's in at 21. All right. Beautiful. Joe, do you want to go 22? Yeah, there's a mark of sights. Sparkling really pretty under this light. Joe's in at 22. Triple C, you want to go 23? I love it. It is a nine two five piece. Mm -hmm. 
I did not clean it other than one spot at the back so I could make sure that the marking was there and then test it. Triple C's at 23. Joe, you want to go 24? I kind of like the darker patina on it. Joe's in at 24. Triple C, you want to go 25? Triple C's in at 25. Joe, you want to go 26? It's well worth it, guys. Joe's in at 26. Triple C, you want to go 27? It is. Diane, it can be used as a pendant also on a chain, and it's um, 925 with the mother of pearl face. Yeah, that's the kind of cameos I like, Mike. I love cameos myself. Triple C's in at 27. Joe, you want to go 28? This is out of my personal collection. Can't keep them all. Joe's in at 28. Triple C, you want to go 29? Kathleen, I hope you feel better. Triple C's in at 29. Joe, you want to go 30? Yeah, I would. Put it right up at the collar. Or you can put it on a pendant. It has a pendant on a chain. Joe's in at 30. Very versatile piece. Triple C, you want to go 31? Oh, Made a funny noise. We're sitting at triple C's in at 31. Joe, you want to go 32? Joe's in at 33. Triple C, you want to go 34? Triple C's out. I did. Okay, he did. He says he talks loud. I don't. <laughs> Okay. Go on, Monster Joe at 33. Thank you, Joe. Go on twice to Joe at 33. Final warning. Beautiful. Thank so, you, Triple C. Thank you, Joe. You're going to love it. Did you make a return? Which one's that? No, I didn't. Can I have my ring? Oh. Okay, guys. I'm not sure if you're going to be interested in this. Is my horse on scale? I'll just I've got a very heavy sterling silver ring. Um, it's, it's kind of a unisex one. If you've got larger fingers, um, it'll work for a man or a woman. This ring. is um almost six ounces just this ring by itself it has a mark that looks like silpata with 925 and then tiling behind it it is a braided heavy ring it's about 11 and a half to 11 and three fourths. And like I said, it's almost six ounces. Very heavy duty ring. Hey, flipping. Very beautiful. 
This is all sterling silver, size 11 and a half, 11 and three fourths in that range. And um, six ounces worth of sterling silver. So I'm going to put this up and I'm going to have to ask 25 for it if anybody is interested. It's a beautiful everyday wear ring. It's um, very sturdy. Hey, Carmen. Yeah, it's a very nice piece. Got a lot of sterling silver weight in it. And like I said, it is marked 925. It does have the two little arrow. Looks like it's got the um, Kilpata sign. I, like I said, I'm not sure. I'm just telling you what I see. And Don it's Town Town 25. That is beautiful. Anybody for 26. Even if you wanted to wear it as a thumb ring, if you could, that would fit. That's very pretty. Don, it's beautiful. I bought it for my daughter, and as I told you guys, she's very picky <laughs> with her stuff. And it was not, it was wider than what she wanted to wear. My name is calling for you. Braided sterling silver. Go ahead and start calling for Don, John. Going once for Dawn's channel for 25. Dawn, I'm going to put my email up here um, just for you to send your information to me. Um, send your PayPal email and your and your mailing address to jwlayton at yahoo.com. Unfortunately, Dragonfly Girl is not with me tonight. Her boyfriend is sick. We hope he gets better. Going twice. This is gorgeous. Fair warning. See the thickness of sterling silver. So, all right, let me get you the little baggie here. Thank you, Don. I know some of you like animals. Um, I just got this in yesterday. It is a froggy. He is sterling. He's tarnished a little bit, and the chain is. I haven't cleaned anything up. Like I said, I just got him in. He has green rhinestone. He's hanging onto the chain. There's a back little that I'm not. Hey, Carmen. I'm feeling okay. All right, Barbie. <laughs> this one I'm going to have to start at $15. It's very cute. Starting the froggy out at 18. Who wants to give me 18? She sounds like a weather warning. What did you say, 18 or 15? I thought you said 18. I'm starting it at $15. Starting at 15, I'm sorry. The weather um, thing can be. The hurricanes. <laughs> Can't hear you headed to the basement. <laughs> All stones are there intact. Thank you, Joe. I appreciate it. Very cute. And a very delicate chain. He is sterling silver. He is marked on the back. And starting the, it up at 15. It was and the chain is marked. And by one hand. <laughs> if nobody's interested, give me two passes. Sterling Silver Frog with green. Diane's in at 15. All right, Diane. This will be cute. Anybody want to give me 16? Don't 
Diane, when you get it, if you've got a polishing cloth, you may just want to go over it where it's tarnished a little bit, unless you want me to do it for you, and then I'll take it out of its original package, and I'll just wipe it down, just shine it up a little bit. Going once for Diane at 15. Going twice. Fair warning. Thank you, Diane. All right, I've got an adjustable ring. That's a peacock feather, a large pink stone, some teal or like emerald green, and some pink stones. There's a slight AB wash to them. This one is a gunmetal color. Still got the feather motif that carries around. I will start this one at $3. Three dollars for the peacock feather ring. Three dollars. What? It's stretchy, so it'll fit on any finger. Autumn's gave me three. He wants to give me three fifty. Lori's in at three fifty. I like how it overlaps on your other finger a little bit. Or if you were to turn it the other way. We'll kind of come off a little bit. Autumn's in at four. Lori's out. Start calling for Autumn. Going once for Autumn for three dollars, four dollars. Going twice. Fair warning. Sold out for four dollars. Thank you, Adam. Thank you, Lori, for bidding. Thank you, Lori. Okay. Got a very cute necklace here. I love how it does the little swag thing. Got a extender in the back. It is, um, I think it's an opalite, but I'm not going to promise that because I don't have a gem tester. So I'm going to say it mimics um, an opalite very well. <laughs> Let you see it close up. I'm going to start this one at $5. Starting this out at five dollars. What size is it? Are you the one that keeps asking that? Um. <laughs> <laughs> He's well, making me work. I'd like to know what size it is. Using the extender, it would go to eighteen inches long. With the extenders, 18 inches. Who wants to give me five dollars? Lord, I've missed it all. The swag piece only. It's not like a total all the way to the back double strand. Jelly gills at five dollars. Who wants to give me five fifty? Yeah, boy. <laughs> John has messed me up now. How there long was we that go. again? 16 inches with the extender, it goes to 18. 16 with the extender, 18. It is silver tone. And it's got an opalite. 
for an, a faux opalite. I'm not going to tell you it's a real one because I don't have that gem tester and it's a little too expensive for me right now. We got deal in at five. Anybody five, fifty or six? That's beautiful. I like the draping and the chain. All right, start calling it. Going right for Gillis, five dollars. Going twice for Gillis, five dollars. <clears throat> Carmen's in at six. Gary, you want to go six fifty or seven? It's beautiful. Very avant garde looking to me. Very Gail's in at six fifty. Carmen, you want to go seven? Very high fashion. Carmen's in at seven. Gail, you want to go seven fifty or eight? Yep. Yeah, Merritt is pretty. I love uh, opalite or opalite imitation. Gail's in at seven fifty. Carmen, you want to go eight? Carmen's in at eight. Gail, you want to go eight fifty or nine? Gail's out. Going once for Carmen for eight dollars. Going twice. Fair warning. Sold to Carmen for $8. Thank you, Gail and Carmen. Thank you, Gail, for bidding. Give me just a minute. I'm getting together a set here. Mama Kay, what time is your yours tomorrow? Yeah, anybody that has an auction that would like to make an announcement, please do this, this coming week. I actually got a couple of pieces that, upon looking at them, they really look like they should go together. Here's a, a necklace. It's red enameled with some pearl, faux pearl seed beads on this long chain. I would guess that it probably be in 30 inches. Here is a little tennis bracelet that's like a faux pearl with a fold over clasp. And then Got a pair of earrings that are the bows in the the red enamel, and they've got the little um, bow pearls at the bottom. So this set of three things, I would start at seven dollars. The necklace by itself is worth that. It's beautiful. It is open on the back. Very cute earrings. Yeah, I like the red. It's really a ruby red. Okay, Patricia White has an auction this Wednesday on the Glam Squad at 8 o'clock. 
going to have Sterling and Vintage. It's going to be on Facebook. As we know, Barbie has an auction on Tuesday. Autumn Grace has one on Thursday. Anybody interested in this beautiful set for $7? Three pieces? Queen of Cards and Alice in Wonderland. Mayor, put that. Mm -hmm, I saw it. <laughs> Anybody want us to go seven? Autumn Gray Senate, seven. This is beautiful. Anybody seven fifty or eight? Yeah. Mary sees it. Barbie sees it. All right, we're gonna go once for Automa seven dollars. Thank you, Cynthia. I love it. Going twice to autumn for seven dollars. Oh, that was your voice. I don't know what John's doing over here. <laughs> Fair warning. It's just a little over two dollars each piece. About two dollars and thirty-three cents. Sold to Autumn for seven dollars. All right, guys. Speaking about animal necklaces and things, I have the sale. It's like a barn owl, not the typical owl we're usually seeing. These are kind of like, um, give off an opalish color. There's some pretty stones here. It's got a little gold wash on it. White enamel. The eyes are an amber color. It is on a long chain. I said, I'm guessing it is 30 inches at least. So it's an excellent shape. Yeah, we're all in different time zones. So if you're making sure you're doing an announcement for your sale, make sure you put what time zone you're in. Let's sell this one for five dollars. Very cute. It's almost like a matte frosted gold. These have uh, Rondell bees with the AV coating on them. We're going to start at five dollars. I appreciate you guys hanging with me. Thank you, Barb. Yeah, it is cute. It's, it's a little different owl than what you're used to seeing. It's a barn owl. Peaches in at five. Where did it come? Oh. Okay, anybody for five fifty? Anybody for five fifty or six? There you go. Very cute. Doesn't have a name brand on it. There is no, absolutely no wear on it. It even has still part of a manufacturer tag, so I don't think it's been worn. Lobster claw. All right, start calling it for peaches. Going once for peaches for $5. 
And I believe these little beads are glass. They're there and then some right above the owl. Very cute. A cream color. I love this stones. They have the opal look. Go on twice. Fair warning. Thank so, you. Teacher for five dollars. Thank you, teacher. All right, got a pair of dangles for you ladies that like dangles and sparkles. These are Leah Sophia necklace uh, uh, earrings. The post back, the smaller circle goes in front. The teardrop with the circle goes behind. It's on the earring backing. It's it. And these are Leah Sophia name brand silver tone. To me, look like they've never been worn at all. Hey, my Skywatch. I'm gonna start these at five dollars. Hey, Robin. Sorry, you're lagging, Kay. Leah Sophia Silvertone earrings for my sparkly and bling bling ladies. It's one of the in front of the ear and behind the ear. It's hooked onto the backing so it's easy to wear. Gail's gave me five. Leah Sophia's here on the back. I think they're very pretty. Dawn's at five fifty. Gail's in at six. Who wants to give me six fifty? Dawn's give me six fifty. Gail, you want to go seven? Very cute. Gail's in at seven. Dawn, you want to go seven fifty or eight? Dawn's in at seven fifty. Yo, you want to go eight? Gail's in at eight. Dawn eight fifty. Dawn's out. Going once for Gail at eight dollars. Going twice for Gail at eight dollars. Final warning. I like the movement in these. Oh, Barbie, if you need to go to sleep, go ahead. You're fine. Sold to Gail for eight dollars. All right. Thank you, Gail, and thank you, Don, for bidding. Give me a stand. Give me just a second. Let me get me a stand here so I can properly show this. That kind of a smaller statement necklace. It's not a BAM statement necklace. It's really cute to me. It's a gold tone that looks a little distressed. Um, like it. It looks. It's like a gold tone that looks a little oxidized. It's all the way across, so I think it's means intentionally. There are metal flowers here. There is a glass bead on the inside of each flower, and then they've got drops here, and these drops um, feel and sound like they're a little glass. They are a purpley pink color. I'm going to start this out at $5. Very cute. All right, Barbie. Who wants to give me five? Good 
going to put it up close so you can see the flowers like um, a two layer flower with the metal. Very cute. You're not interested give me a pass or give me a pin it's it's not a huge version of it all oh, right it's very pretty anybody five feet or six All right, going once to Dawn for $5. I love this, Dawn. You're going to like it a lot. It's really cute. Going twice for Dawn's channel at $5. All Fair right. warning. So, to Don's channel for $5. Is there anything anybody wants me to go back to? Do you want me to go back to more animals? Do you want me to go to brooches, rings, um, sterling? Let me know. Oh, Don, I bet it will be beautiful. Animal. Animal? Owl. Okay. I hit owls. I picked a turtle up first. I've got a turtle. This ring He's encrusted in clear stones. He's got two for the eyes. It's an enameled black around it. The top of him is kind of a gunmetal. The bottom of the ring is a little more silver. It is distressed looking. That's the way it's made. Gonna start this stretchy ring out at four dollars. Do to all the work in the stones. No stones are missing. Who wants to give me four dollars for the turtle? He's cute. Let me put him on my finger for you. I'm Grace in at four. Anybody four fit your five? I'm just amazed all his stones are there, as many as he has. You wonder where he came from, Meredith? This was a Meredith special. We're sitting at $4. Go ahead and start calling it. Going on. once for Autumn at $4. I'll sell all your things, Meredith, so we can buy you something you're going to like. Going twice for Autumn at $4. This ring was bought from Lane Bryant. I do remember that. Never worn. Fair warning. Sold to Autumn Grace for $4. All right. Here you go. Okay. I've got an owl here. Robin, I have one owl that I think you have a duplicate of, so I'm not even going to put that up there because I think uh, Dragonfly Girl gave you one when she sent us a duplicate. This is a really cute owl. It's kind of on a brass tone. It's got different color enameling and black eyes. I would guess that it probably a 30 inch. Uh, it does have a lobster claw clasp. I think he's cute. 
my sky watch you missed i had a beautiful barn owl kind of a different type of owl i've already sold him and we're going to start this one out at four dollars easter egg <laughs> yeah it does who wants to give me four dollars autumn's race to me four my sky watch four fifty or five Steven got his little feet down here on a branch. Cute. Every, just the links are textured within the chain. So it's not just a plain chain. My Skywatch Channel 450. Autumn, you want to do five. I'm going to have to go look for more animals. Jenny's back. <laughs> hey, Jenny. Autumn's out. Going once for my Skywatch at 450. Going twice for my sky watch at 450. Oh. Jenny's in at five. All right. Oh, swooped in, my sky watch. You want to go 550? All right, start calling. Going once to Jenny for $5. My sky watch is out. Going twice. Dalton. No. Going. That needs a battery. Fair warning. Sold Jenny for $5. All right. Here you go, John. Okay. I've got a zebra brooch. It's all gold tone. I don't have a name brand on him. If anybody would like this for $3, just type in zebra. This is a buy it now. If you'd like this for $3, type in zebra. Three. Three dollars? Yeah, three dollars. If you want it, type in zebra. Type in zebra. Autumn, if you want it, type zebra. All right. All Autumn right. Grace. Autumn Grace. Good night, Sydney. Good night, Sydney. Oh, wow, Triple C, you got 99 subs. Robin, I think this is one that you have. An owl you already have. It's got pink, purple, yellow, and blue. It's on a long chain. Who would, whoever would like this owl necklace for... Four dollars. Type in blue. Four dollars. Buy now. 
Hey, Francis. Hey, Francis. That's okay, Sandy. It happens. Buy it now for four dollars. Type in blue. This is an owl necklace. Buy it now if you'd like it for four dollars to type in blue. If you don't, let me know. We'll pass. What kind? Of, oh, and I can't turn my head. That's not Pluto. That's a cameo. I don't know. We'll see. All right, I'm going to take this away, but if you decide you want it, let me know. just a second okay this is in the batch of bracelets that i bought a while ago it is made to appear like um amethyst druzy on the back it is marked 925 but this is ones that um i believe are not sterling silver i believe it is um german silver and I believe that these crystals are not amethyst. It just doesn't have the color. And I see a few spots where it's a little darker here or there. This does tarnish just like sterling. It wears like sterling. It doesn't turn. Has a toggle clasp with multiple different spacers. The main one has a rope design around it. It is beautiful. It's got a nice presence to it. Let me measure it. At its longest, it would be eight. Uh, so you would need at least a seven and three fourths or smaller to be able to wear it because you know you gotta have extra room for the toggle. This one is gonna go starting at $10. Just selling it as a silver tone with Druzy. Ten dollars gets a lot of notice. I have had tons of compliments on this. This came from my personal stash. If you're not interested, just type pass. Up next, we're going to do another bag, and then we will do uh, another giveaway. Hey, Four Eyed Hustler. Yeah, I'm fine. Thank you, Peaches. Just prop it on my hand. Who wants to give us 10? It's really pretty. If you're not interested, just do pass. Gives a lot of flash. No, no, Brandon Knight, Francis, her boyfriend, who was really bad off sick tonight. He got violently ill at about 7 o'clock tonight. So it's been all Jennifer tonight. <laughs> I appreciate y'all bearing with me. I know Brenda's the funny, funny, funny one in the bunch. She keeps you laughing. She keeps me laughing, too. I'm going to measure it on my forehead like uh, Dom does. Dom Maserati. <laughs> 
No, I haven't started selling on eBay yet. I'm I'm thinking about it right now. I'm just strictly on um YouTube. I say I'm bad. Okay, I'm gonna take this one away. If you decide you want it, let me know. We've got a pretty elephant brooch. This is just open with these little stones in. Micro pave right here on the ear and it's a red eye. If you would like this brooch for, and this is the back of it. If you would like the brooch for $4, pop in red. Buy it now. For four dollars, type in red. Don, channel. All right, thank you, Don. Okay, we're gonna do a bag of jewelry. Okay. This is uh, about a sandwich size bag. It is one pound and 7.8 ounces. So know when you get this, I will stick your other things in like a flat rate bubble mailer. So I'm putting up your CNC. There is a stretchy dangle bracelet. This is a necklace that has glass daisies. There's a lot of vintage in this. This three strand necklace is a vintage right there as part of the class. There's some vintage earrings here, vintage 80s earrings here. This is the teardrop. This one is gonna start out at $10. $10 for this bag starting out. Who wants to give me 10? These are some really pretty earrings. There's a necklace that has marker sites on it. It's a teardrop shape. All right, I got Lori in at 10. Who wants to give me 11? Here's some glass bead necklace. This right here is a vintage necklace also. There's a stretchy ring back in there. Triple C's in 11. Who wants to give me 12? That red bangle is a leather bracelet. I think from like Kenneth Cole. Carmen's in at 12. Who wants to give me 13? There's lots of bracelets, earrings, necklaces. Autumn Press is in at 13. Who wants to give me 14? Some rings. These are new on the card. Poop earrings from Maurice's. Carmen's in at 14. Who wants to give me 15? There's some very pretty rhinestones that are on like a memory wire necklace that's black with uh, rhinestone dangle drops. There is a mesh bangle. Whoops. One pound, 7.85 ounces. We're sitting at 14. Who wants to give me 15? Several, several things in here. Yeah, the flowers, Meredith, are um, actually glass daisies on the necklace. I believe that to be a vintage piece also. There's lots of things in here I can't see. I forget what I put in. And who knows, I may add a couple of more pieces to it. Carmen's in at 14. Who wants to give me 15? That's a big chunky bracelet right there. A stainless steel Italian bracelet. It does have charms on it. Lori's in at 15. Who wants to give me 16? Carmen's in at 16. Who wants to give me 17? Of 
Carmen, I, did you get a jewelry bag last time? You know I put good stuff in there. Lori's in at 17. Who wants to give me 18? That's a really pretty stretchy ring with orange crystals. No wear on it at all. Try to put a good variety in here. Hey, Roberta. Hey, Roberta. I love the vintage pieces up here. It's got multiple shades. It's pink, a kind of an orangey color, and then a wine color. Carmen in at 18. Gloria gave me 19. Carmen's in at 20. Y'all like these? I'll do another one. That's a cute, like a vintage necklace right there. We're sitting at $20. Class. Who wants to give me 21? Okay, start calling it. Going once for twenty dollars. Lori's out. Going twice for coming for twenty dollars. Fair warning. All right. Oh, Thank you. I know you're going to love it. Okay. Where's my trivia questions? We're going to get ready to do a giveaway. What it's going to be is it's going to be the first one that gives me the correct answer to a trivia question. Um, so get ready, refresh, do what you need to do. I'm going to be picking out a question. And let me see what we're going to do for a prize. It's going to be an angel brooch that is by Avon. Let me find me something here. Let me find us something good. All right, this card is about rings. Now, it's not just necessarily the jewelry rings. It can be any type of ring, any type. So I'm going to read the question. The first one to put the answer in will win. Name the laundry detergent that famously removed ring around the collar. Name the laundry detergent that famously removed ring around the collar. No, I haven't seen the right answer yet. Nope. It's not tied, not shout. Nope. <laughs> Don't all of them. <laughs> no, it was a, it wasn't, it was like a kind of, you, you pre-treated it with it. Nope. Nope. Oh, triple. Uh, no, Gail A got it with whisk. All right. So Gail A, you get the angel brooch. Here you go, John. Triple C, you were right behind her. All right. Does anybody want sterling silver? Oh, behind. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Okay. What with earrings? Yeah, it was fun, wasn't it? Lori. Yeah, I like doing those little questions. Let me just. I don't know that I would remember that one either. Okay. I'm looking for Okay. This ring is a size seven. 
It is sterling silver. Let me get it out so I can show you. Well, hope, let's see if it'll show up on the manual. It is a imitation, kind of like a wrap ring. Just got the pieces on the front. They're concave. It's narrower on the back for a comfortable fit. It's a size seven. This one would start at fifteen dollars. Show you on my finger. Gives a good press for the rain. Lori's in at fifteen. It's pretty. Are you calling in? Lori's in at fifteen. I don't know if John got the Sandman. <laughs> Sorry, Kay. What size ring do you need? Anybody yeah, wants to be 15, 50, or 16? <laughs> You're tired too, Lori. I know. I didn't sleep good, so I took a long nap this afternoon, so I think that's going to keep me up a little bit. All right, start calling for Lori. She's getting Going once for Lori at 15. Lori, this is so pretty. Going twice for Lori at 15. Fair warning. Sold to Lori for 15. Thank you, Lori. Let's see what I got, Case. I got anything. Yeah, the race car is going round and round. Put her to sleep. Uh -huh. It tries I got some nines. Okay, this one goes to about a nine and a quarter, but it's a narrow band. It might work for you. Um, it's got little accents on the shoulders. It is a very large oval smoky quartz. It's a nine, between a nine and a nine and a quarter. I feel like it runs a little bit bigger. Um, this one will start at 15 also. This is really pretty. Starting this one off at 15. Who wants to give me 15? Good night, Jenny. Good night, Jenny. Is that smoky quartz? Yes. All right. Good night, Mama Kay. It's whisk, CC. That's uh, nine and a quarter. Sterling silver with smoky quartz. No, Roberta, just not dancing yet. No. <laughs> the last couple of days were tough for me, but I'm sure I'm going to have up and down days. So I just rested. I got to go to the doctor Wednesday, and that's like an hour, hour and 15 minutes one way. Autumn's All right, Autumn Gray Santa, 15. All right. Who wants to give me 16? <laughs> oh, she retracted it. 
Autumn. Oh, okay. Okay, Autumn, no problem. All right. Anybody at 15? I can put it up. Thank you, Roberta. Beautiful ring. All right. All right, we're going to put that ring up. Anybody want to look at any more rings? That's okay. Let's see what we got here. Let me get a little situated here and get a little more comfortable. I've got a three stone ring. It's about an eight and a quarter. It's got a twisted band. These are CZs with sterling. Good night. Okay. It fits the finger really well. I'm going to start this one out at 10. And it is sterling. Good night, Mama Kay. Is anyone interested in this ring for 10? Ten dollar. Who wants to give me ten dollar? Anybody 10 or two passes? Okay, we must be tired of rings. See what we got. What size was it? Eight. Size eight. Too big. Pass. Okay. All right. We'll put it up for another night. Don't okay. work too hard. This is a silver tone necklace. It's also another um, stone. I believe this one to be like a red egg. But Gonna start this one out at five dollars. Five dollars. Who wants to give me five dollars? Gold stone. No, it just looks like a red agate. Like you can see some banding on the Diane, side. Give me five. Who wants to give me five fifty? I do have a beautiful goldstone necklace and earring set I just got in recently. Um, I can show. I've got to find it. Yeah. That one I showed you today had the copper. These will help me look. Anybody want to go for five fifty or six? This is really cute. You may want to charge it today. Hmm. Okay. I'm just asking you to remember. Yeah, it, it, the gold stone in that one. Oh my gosh, there's some that are square cut that just really pop. I love gold stone too. <laughs> I have some really nice stuff. I've got some sterling silver that actually has like some raw sapphire little stalactites kind of hanging down. Um, I just don't know what everybody, if everybody just wants inexpensive stuff, I can do that. But if you're really looking for things that are in the 15 to $20 range, then I have some things that I can do like that. I just, 
I don't want to put a whole lot of expensive stuff up here and it not be what you guys want. Don't want to waste your time. All right, we're going to call it going once to Diane for $5. It wasn't, you know. Going twice to Diane for $5. You like sterling and stone? Okay, well, I'll show some things. Are there others in here that like sterling and stones? Sold to Diane for $5. Thank you, Diane. Okay, while he's looking, congratulations. I'm going to show you an elephant pendant. The elephant um, has a decorative blanket and then some decorative ankle things with rhinestones on them. It has a long silver tone. I'm guessing it's probably at least 30 inches. Looks like it's got an earring in. My kind of elephant, blingy. No, Dalton, not Amber. Um, I'm going to start this one out at $4. Anybody interested in the pretty elephant? You know what it's like when you're trying to look for one piece and probably 900 pieces of jewelry. <laughs> Anybody interested for $4? Cute elephant that's blinged out. All right, got Autumn Grace in at $4. Is anybody interested in uh, bidding um, $5? All right, I'm going to start calling for Autumn Grace. Going once for Autumn Grace at four dollars. Going twice for Autumn Grace at four dollars. No. Laura's in at four fifty. All right, because it shows up slower on mine through Streamyard. All right, we got Lori in at four fifty. Autumn, do you want to go five? Well, I'm not going to be telling you to go down or not. Got Autumn in at five. Lori, you want five fifty? This is the best new stuff I gave you that I thought yesterday. All right, Autumn, do you want to go six? Lori's in at five fifty. Autumn's in at seven. Lori's out. We'll start calling for Autumn. Going once. Going twice for Autumn. Final warning. Sold to Autumn Grace. Did you get the one that was signed? Okay. Sold to on a neck wire, kind of a copper necklace, it goes down, has a beautiful stone, it's really glass, the, it's wrapped, there it is. and it's got iridescence within it, 
It also has a bracelet that has similar color stones to go along with it. I'm going to start this one at um, $15. Is there anyone interested? The fold over class. Beautiful glass and stone, glass and silver tone. Yeah. Starts at $15. Who wants to give me $15? I love how this is wrapped. <laughs> I love the way this looks. It will start at $15. You're not interested, give me a pass. I love this. Okay, how about a twelve dollar start? Who wants to give me twelve dollars? I'll go down. Twelve dollars. That's kind of rock bottom on what I can do for this. They show you the bracelet on my wrist. Beautiful. Yeah, Lynn, I'm still on. I'm on for probably another 15 minutes. This plus the necklace that goes along with it. Starting at $12. $12. Who wants to give me $12? That's a heck of a deal right here at $12. That's not probably going to be the still of the night. $12. Anybody for 12 If you're not interested, just pass. And if you think about it, if this is the thing that haunts you tomorrow and you say, I've got to have it, all you got to do is email me. We'll do a buy it now at $12. If you type in green, it'll be yours. Buy it now at $12. All right, ladies, I'm going to take it away. All right. We found the gold stone. Well, Lynn, if you just, when things turn, you know, you want to buy something, if you let me know, if I still have it two months from now, it's yours, okay? If I don't sell it. Hey, Michelle. Hey. Hey, hey Laura. Hey, Lori. Okay, I've got some um, gold stone. I've got a gold stone set. It's got gold stone dangles. It's actually um, on like copper wrapped um, strands coming down. These are the mm, the stream yard. These are the gold stone earrings. They've got the sparkle. For. You want the twelve dollar one, Lori? Oh, okay. Sorry. She was letting Lori know. Got two Lori's in here. Okay. These are the earrings and I'm going to hold it up so you can see the, the copper wire wrapping. They're beautiful. Let me show you the necklace. The necklace is wonderful. It has a magnetic clasp. It looks to be artisan made. We'll do it right after this one right here. Creative. And then it has a matching pendant down here on the bottom. And what I was telling you about earlier is these ones, these flat cubes sparkle so much. Those have got sparkle. So the necklace, all that gold stone on it. And the earrings 
We're going to start this out at $15. Gold sewn set. Necklace and earrings starting out at 15. Who wants to give me 15? I love gold stone too. I want to get me some green gold stone. That's the most rare. Looks artisan made. With this uh, copper wire wrapping. Thank you, Lori. Yeah, I like them too. In the center, there's a all round beads that are slightly faceted and then these are the goldstone chunks. Yeah, they have green. They have um, a like a dark blue. Uh, it looks like the night sky. But green is the most rare. Yeah, green is the most rare. I saw it at the gym show when I went and I meant to buy a piece to show you guys and forgot. So when I go at the end of this month, I'm going to buy a piece and I'll show you. I think too, what I'm going to do um, on my weekly auctions is we're going to do a thing kind of to learn about different stones, maybe how to make sure that they're real or different things like that, like testing amber, testing coral, um, or just some different features of stones. We may start doing some things like that. So if there's some particular stones you want to learn about, send it to my email, jwlayton at yahoo.com. Okay, Lori, no problem. Yeah, this is 15. Michelle asked you a question. Yeah, like your ring and your earrings. They're called goldstone. Yep. See the sparkles? Starting out at 15. Who wants to give me 15? If nobody's interested, I'm going to go back and show uh, Lori that necklace and bracelet. Yeah, I love this too. Woo. Look good on me. <laughs> okay, I'm going to take it away. If you decide you may want it, let me know. Yeah, the necklace is great. Let me put these back up. All right, where's the next why don't you put that next? Hold on. I got one that likes to put things up before I'm done with the glass. How heavy was the earring, son? On that they're set? not really heavy. They're, they're not feather light, but they're not going to weigh your ears down. Okay, Lori. This is if I, um, neck wire. You know, you, those things can stretch. That is the pendant. It's glass. With some iridescent in it, it's wrapped. It's um silver oh, also. My bad people. This is the bracelet. It has multi types of glass. Show it on. For real. And Lori, it would fit my wrist. And I usually wear about a seven and a half. So I think you would be okay. But I was starting this um, at $10. There's no one else did. If you're interested in it, I can sell both pieces to you for $10. If you'd like, let me know. Kind of reminds me of the Caribbean Ocean or something. Yes, it is silver tone. Refresh, Roberta, see if it helps. Okay, Lori, I'll put these up. Just let me know if you're interested. Uh, you got my email, jwlayton at yahoo.com. Just let me know. She'll take it. Okay. All right, Lori. Got it. I got your info. All right, Michelle, the earrings are 0.25 ounces. And the necklace is to the longest point, 20. Thank you, Lori. I know you're going to love it. 
Hmm? The necklace? Yeah, it, you double it. The blue point is going in the way. Okay. The shortest point is going in the I've got, um, these are like crystal quartz here. I don't see any marking on this. I think this is an artisan made piece. I, I'm going to say silver tone. I haven't tested it. I'm waiting on my test kit. Um, it's, got kind of, it's got an older hook in the back or a different kind of lobster claw, but it looks like it's handmade. It's got the little crystal quartz. You can even see one of them's even got like some natural discoloration in it. Um, I'm going to start this one out at um, $10. We try. Sometimes you'll see me give them a bad look, but I can't help it. I can't hide what I'm feeling. <laughs> That's my damn fault. <laughs> and I'm impatient. He knows it. Anybody want to start this at ten dollars? Ten dollars. Diane, give me ten. It's pretty, Diane. You want to see it again, too? Mm -hmm. We can pull it up again after this. All right, Diane's in at 10. Anybody? 11. Yeah, we'll show you it again, Diane. Not Diane, Michelle. Yeah. <laughs> All right, going once for Diane at ten dollars. Yeah, Diane, I think that you're you're, uh, you're a lot smaller person than I am. Uh, it would look a lot better on you than me. It's, it's um delicate, but it is enough that it's going to show. And be really cold. Going twice to Diane for 10. <laughs> All right. I'm sure y'all going to get screenshots of the looks I give him. <laughs> Final. Lori, Lori was 10.50. Diane's in 11. Lori, you want to go 12? Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll do another bag before we close out. I may do one more piece and then a bag. Michelle wants us to see that. Yeah, I'll show, I'll show that to Michelle. After All right, one twice for Diane at 11. I'm glad y'all are liking my higher end pieces. Lori's out. Fair warning. Now I know who to bring them out for. <laughs> Francis, you missed it. I sold a um, sterling silver cameo brooch and pendant combination tonight. Sold to Diane for $11. Uh, somebody took the gallstone necklace. What'd you do with Little that? Boy. <laughs> Little boy took it. All right. Let's see if I can get this here. Here are the earrings. The necklace mimics the same thing at the bottom. It's got multiple stones. And it does have a magnetic clasp at the back. It is artisan made. There are rounds, squares, and chips of goldstone in there. These are like wrapped copper wire. I hold it up close. But it's an artisan made piece. And this one is um fifteen dollars. Michelle wants it. You want it? All right, Michelle. You'll be like me, decked out in goldstone. Thank you, sweetie. 
Okay, I'm going to show one more piece and then I'm going to do another bag and then we will bid adieu. Now, if I feel like it, I may do a pop up or another option sometime this week. But generally, Brenda and I do on Sunday nights at nine o'clock. We always appreciate you guys being here. Oh, let me grab another piece here. Okay, so she kind of liked my gems. This one is a piece of amethyst that's wire wrapped. And this chain is a box chain. It does have these curling marks on the back of it. But it is a piece of amethyst. You can see the natural cracks and the swirls and the marbling within the stone. It's really pretty. Paul, let me measure how long the necklace is. I'm losing my voice or something. Yes, yeah, really pretty. I've been collecting things. It is 18 inches long with a sterling silver chain. I love the wrapping on it. This one's going to start at 15. $15. Who wants it's to give me 15? Answer. Yeah, it is really pretty. Brenda's going to kill me if she's looking or she looks back because of the stone stuff I sold. <laughs> Autumn Grace Santa, 15. Who wants to give me 15, 50, or 16? That's pretty, Autumn. Brenda just looks dumb. She's going to kill me. She hates amethyst. <laughs> My birthstone is pearl or alexandrite, and um, I love pearls. Go on once for autumn and for 15. I like the shape of um, I graduate soon. It's more narrow at the bottom. Going twice for 15 for autumn. <laughs> At the gym show, we had a man that had uh, actually freshly mined some things there. Oh, no problem, Diane. All right. Sold, Autumn Grace for 15. All right, don't pay me a jewelry bag. Another bag. Okay. Got a jewelry bag here. You see these little green? They're glass beads. And there's some Milly Fiore beads as part of it. It's woven in with seed beads. There is a kind of a native style. It's not real native, but just um, imitation native. Um, there's some pearls. We're going to start this one at $7. $7 start. It weighs, what did it weigh? One pound, 3.35. It's uh, a smaller one. That's why I started at seven. Glory's in at seven. Who wants to give me eight? There's a necklace with some feathers. There's some pearls. I believe the pearls are vintage. Michelle's in at nine. Who wants to give me ten? Lori's in at fourteen. Who wants to give me fifteen? This on top, the gold with the balls, is a handmade piece by um, Vita that shows up in... Um, Cindy loves jewelry. She made that. It is beautiful. She took um pieces of vintage jewelry that was broken and remade it. There's a mesh chain in there. Michelle's in at 15. Who wants to give me 16? There's some key earrings. Lori's in at 17. Who wants to give me 18? 
There's a piece of mother of pearl. It's kind of hard. She in at 19. Anybody 20? Lori's in at 20. Who wants to give me 21? And y'all know I probably will throw some more things in here. So have no fear. I love that, those green stars, that necklace. Shells out. Going once for Lori at 20. That's a Chinese imitation Chinese. All right, go ahead and let's start curling it for Lori. Going twice for Lori at 20. Fair warning. That's a silver statement necklace. I believe it's never been worn. Sold to Lori for 20. Thank you. Thank what you, I Lori. Thank you, Michelle, for bid. Okay, while I can sit, I want to do one more giveaway. So, bear with me just a minute. Let me grab a prize here. Something that everybody can. And I would not have the bracelets. Hmm? Not the bracelets. I'm going to give away my little owl. That's so pretty. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do another trivia question. Everybody get ready. Give me just a second. Trying to find one we now know. Okay, this is about brands and logos and stuff. So I'm going to show you a logo for a company. And you are the first one to tell me the name of the company. And this is easy. So you better be quick. Refresh, refresh. Everybody do that right now. Thank you, Lori, for staying the whole time. What is this brand? What restaurant? I noticed some bag. Sandra Garrison, Taco Bell. Sandra, can you send me your information? I'm not sure that I have it. I don't think you've ever bought from me. And that doesn't stop you from getting anything. But if you'll send your email, uh, email, you can send your address to me because uh, there's no reason. You don't have to send PayPal. But if you want to go ahead and send it, I'm not going to charge you for anything. Shipping's on me. But if you want to go ahead and send it in case you see something the next time or the next time, then I'll have everything together. Okay? Congratulations, Sandra. Told y'all that was pretty easy. I greatly appreciate you guys joining us tonight. This makes my day, but I feel bad. At least I can come in here and get dressed up and put me some jewelry on and feel a little bit better. Um, you guys made my week. If you have some long legs. I'm sorry, Lori. All right. We love you. Thank you, and we'll see you next week. Bye-bye.